Hey, good evening, folk. How you doing? Welcome to the uh, the Kitchen Draw live stream. Hope uh, hope everyone's having a nice evening. Uh, I'm just going to uh, get the stream up on my tablet here so I can keep an eye on the comments. Uh, here we go. Yeah, how are you all? How are you all? I hope your uh, hope your week has started well. Hope you're keeping warm and dry. It's pretty nasty out there at the moment. Um, just making sure that the stream is working properly. Um, yeah, let me know if there are any issues with the video. Let me know if there are any issues with the audio. Uh, all seems to be working my end at the moment, as far as I can tell. Um, but do let me know if there's any evenings. Um, I've tried tweaking the microphone a bit, so hopefully the crackling is gone. But uh, let me know, please, if it is still there. And we'll go on to trying the next fix. Um, the crackling did go away for a while there, but seems to have returned uh, the last couple of weeks. Hey Kelly, hey Megan, hope you guys are well. Hey Chris and Carolyn, how are you guys? Hope you're having a nice Tuesday. Uh, Chris, you're usually pretty good at letting me know how the uh, the crackle is on the mic, so uh, yeah, let me know how it is. Carolyn, bit of crackling, still crackling unfortunately. Oh man, so frustrating. I thought it was Bluetooth interference, so I've turned off all the other Bluetooth uh, in the area, but uh, seems that that hasn't resolved it. So it's fine, on to the next fix. Uh, we'll try something new next week, but hopefully it's uh, it's not too unbearable. Hey, Samantha, how are you? A bit crackly, yeah. All right, uh, well, s turns out we haven't fixed it, but uh, we'll cre keep trying uh, different things, and uh, if it doesn't resolve itself, we'll just have to buy a new mic for a couple of weeks' time. Hey, Ali, how you doing? Thanks for joining, nice to have you here. Looks like we've got, uh, yeah, it looks like we've got 16 or 17 people on the stream. So, uh, yeah, that's that's a, a good amount. I think we can probably make a start in a minute. Hey, Lisa, how you doing? Good to have you here. Hope you're uh, having a nice Tuesday. Uh, right, guys, we have three prizes to draw today. Um, the first one, tucked in behind me here, uh, will be the Barbary and Oak dinnerware set. Uh, first time we've done anything from Barbary and Oak, but this is a lovely little dinnerware set. Um, it's for four people, so it's a 16 piece. It's got uh, dinner plates, side plates, uh, bowls and mugs. I'll give you a closer look in a minute uh, when I switch the camera view. Um, we had 100 tickets available for that dinnerware set and we sold 40. Um, so if you've entered, you've got pretty good odds of winning. Uh, one in 40 tonight um, for, for each ticket. Um, we're going to go through the usual process. So we'll have the, uh, the entry list up on the screen here behind me. I'll change the camera view in a minute so you get a better look at that. Uh, and we'll use Google Random Number Generator to pull our winners. Um, for any prize draw, uh, if the Google Random Number Generator does pull a number that hasn't been allocated, because uh, none of the draws did sell out this week, um, we will re-roll re the Random Number Generator until we find ourselves a winner. Um, so we don't roll the, the draws forward, uh, the prizes don't um, go back in the cupboard, we will make sure that we find ourselves a winner. Because um, I think we've got a few uh, a few new names in this week, and I think I've spotted a couple of unfamiliar uh, names in the chat already. So uh, just good to let you, uh, you newbies know how it all works, um, if this is your first time. Pretend it's your real voice. Uh, yeah, like... <laughs> Almost, almost thought I'd do a robot dance there, but I don't think my robot dancing skills are, are quite up to scratch, Nikki. Hey, Sandy, how you doing? Hope your, uh, hope your prize arrived all good and you're, uh, you're enjoying that. Hey, Jonathan and Susan, hope you guys are well. Fingers crossed for the dinnerware set, Samantha. Love it so much. Absolutely lick the plate. Yeah, let me give you a closer look at this stuff. Um, there's the. Uh, there's the bowl there. Hopefully you can see that all right. Yeah, so it's a lovely uh, terracotta um, with a. Uh, like a slate glaze, um, but they've left some of that terracotta exposed there on the bottom. So it uh, looks really nice. Uh, it's, dinner, um, it's dishwasher safe and it's microwave safe as well, this stuff. So pretty much fit for any home. Uh, Radio, let's change the view <clears throat> so that you guys can see the uh, what's going on on the screen behind me a little bit clearer. Uh, yep, looks like that's flipped over uh, nicely. Absolutely loving the air fryer, Sandy. Brilliant. We'll post some pics soon. Oh, lovely. Yeah, if you could do that. We, uh, we do love seeing the pictures from our winners um, and posting those on social media. Uh, it gives me a bit of a buzz. Um, 
Radio. So the Barbary and Oak Verona 16 piece dinner we set. Let's take a look. Um, like I said, we had 40 entries of a possible 100. So I'll give you a quick look at the entry list there. Um, obviously, there are some pretty big gaps in there. 60% um, of the tickets didn't sell. Um, but like I said at the top, if we do happen to pull a number that doesn't have a name against it, we'll just re roll and we'll make sure that we find ourselves a winner. Uh, seeing a few new names in there that I haven't seen crop up before, I think. And of course, uh, a lot of familiar names coming through as well. So welcome to the newbies and uh, welcome back to people who have been with us uh, before. Uh, good luck to everyone that's entered. Let's grab the random number generator and pop those parameters in there. So we're looking at 1 to 100 for the dinnerware set from Barbary and Oak. 1 to 100. I'm going to click generate and uh, fingers crossed we find a winner first time round. But no worries if we don't. Again, good luck to everyone that's entered. Let's see who our first winner is of the evening. Little drum roll. And it's 39. So for the dinner we set, number 39, let's see if we've got ourselves a winner. We do. I can see a name there. Oh, it's someone who has won before, but they haven't won in a few weeks, possibly a couple of months even. Uh, Kay D'Souza from Essex with ticket number 39. So you can see the 39 up there. You can see the 39 on the entry list. Kay D'Souza from Essex. Congratulations to you. You have won the Barbary and Oak dinnerware set. Let's whack your details in here. Uh, winning entry was 39. Winning name was Kay D'Souza. Uh, yeah, I think you've won once or twice before. I know your husband has won as well. So you guys have uh, taken a few things home from us, but it has been um, I'd say a good two, two and a half months since, uh, since your name has come up. So congratulations, um, you won again. Uh, yeah, we'll be getting that courier off to you tomorrow. Um, I'll be in touch, just confirm the delivery address and all that. Make sure you get it couriered to the right place. But congratulations. Uh, let's get that moved off. Uh, I'm going to pop it somewhere safe. And we will grab the next prize. Hopefully you guys can see that. All right. Radio, let us move on. I'm going to reset the random number generator first. Back to zero. Reset that back to zero and then move on to draw number two. Draw number two is for the Ninja Foodie Max Dual Zone Air Fryer. Um, very, very popular. Um, looks like it's pretty hard to get in shops again. Uh, pretty hard to get online. We've managed to snaffle ourselves one or two um, and obviously we have a few people hoping to win that tonight. So for the air fryer we had 150 entries available and we had 108 tickets sold. So 108 <coughs> of possible 150 entries. So um, not quite a sellout but uh, getting close. So we've got a fairly long entry list there which we'll take a look at. There's Kirsty D'Souza in the chat. Congratulations to you. I'm glad you're watching. I uh, always love it when the, uh, when the winners are watching and uh, we can have a little celebration with them. So well done. And like I said, we'll get that career off to you tomorrow, Kirsty. You can make crisps with crab sticks. I'm going, I'm going to win the one later and try. Crisps with crab sticks. Is that the air fryer, Jonathan? I assume it must be. Kelly's confused. Come on the air fryer, Jonathan's in for the air fryer. Who else is in for the air fryer? Uh, if you are, let us know in the comments. Uh, Radio, let's take a quick <clears throat> quick look at that entry list um, so that if you have entered, you can see your name in there. Uh, as I said, 108 of 150 tickets were taken, so it's a pretty busy list. Lots of names in there, all around the country. North Yorkshire, as always, featuring Wiltshire, Surrey, Ayrshire, as always, Edinburgh. I'm not going to pronounce all of these very well. Torfan, is it? <clears throat> First time that's come up, I believe. Dorset, South Yorkshire even, London, everywhere's represented. So uh, let's whip back up to the top. And let's get the uh, parameters popped into the random number generator. So we're looking at 150 total tickets available for the air fryer, 1 to 150 on the random number generator there. So for the Ninja Foodie Max Dual Zone Air Fryer, 108 tickets sold. Let's see who's going to be the winner. 
Good luck to everyone that's entered. Little drum roll. Google random number generator has chosen 120. Number 120 for the air fryer. Let's see if we've got ourselves a winner. Like I say every week, if you're not sure what your numbers are and you want to know, uh, they will be in the uh, order confirmation email that you received when you uh, paid for your tickets. Uh, they'll also be sitting in your account on the website. So if you log into your account on the website, you'll be able to see your tickets in there. Uh, I know some people prefer not to know what their ticket numbers are though and just uh, see if they've won on the day. So here we go, 120 for the air fryer. Do we have a winner? We do indeed. First time winner. This name has not come up before. From Surrey. J Prince, ticket number 120 on the random number generator on the entry list, J Prince from Surrey, ticket number 120, congratulations to you, you are now the proud owner of a Ninja Dual Zone Air Fryer, uh, we will get in touch after the draw, confirm your details and get that carried off to you tomorrow. Uh, if you happen to be watching the stream, give us a little celebration in the chat, um, if you're not, if you happen to watch it later on, Still congratulations, and if you don't watch it at all, well, still congratulations. Um, to everyone else who uh, was hoping to win the air fryer, there will be another one next week, so you can continue to try your luck. Uh, the whole of Yorkshire is in there, Chris. It does look like it some weeks, doesn't it? <laughs> the whole of North Yorkshire, at least. Heard it's good for chips and gravy. Kelly's excited for seeing you be in there. One away, Johnny Lee. One away, Johnny Lee, indeed. 119. Oh, you were so keen for it as well. Lovely to see all the congrats in there, though. Uh, always great to see you guys congratulating the winners. Uh, I do love that about you guys. You are a bloody friendly bunch. Right, let's get the details popped in there before I move on to draw number three. Winning entry, 120. Winner name, J Prince. Cool. Let's reset the random number generator to zero, just to avoid any uh, mishaps. And we'll move on to the third prize draw of the night. Let's uh, get it up on the desk so you can actually see what it is that we're running a draw for. Hopefully the new desk layout is working. Uh, for people who are here week in, week out, you'll notice that I have switched things up a bit. I think it works a little bit better. Um, just allows me to display the prizes a bit clearer. Um, free up a bit of space around the room. This is quite a big one though, <laughs> so hopefully um, hopefully the desk doesn't collapse and hopefully you guys can see it all right, but uh, looking at my tablet here, it looks like uh, it looks like it's all good. Um, the desk is rated for eight kilograms and this box is 12 kilograms, so uh, we'll see how we go. Uh, yeah, pizza oven. Oh, I love a pizza. Um, I don't have a pizza oven, but I would love a pizza oven. Um, yeah, this is the Uni Karoo 12 multi-fuel pizza oven. Uh, why is it multi-fuel? Well, out of the box, you can use it with um, wood chip kindling. Uh, you can use it with uh, lump charcoal, or you can use it with gas, but not out of the box, because if you do win this and you want to use it with gas, you do need to buy a separate accessory to use it with gas. But out of the box, you can use it with wood and you can use it with uh, charcoal. And then if you decide you want to use gas as well, that option will be available to you. So yeah, pretty uh, pretty cool little pizza oven. Um, please don't use it inside <laughs> if you do win. Um, but obviously you can take it away camping, take it on picnics, um, use it in the back garden. Uh, it would be uh, make you pretty popular, I think. Uh, so we had 150 entries available for the pizza oven and we received 103 entries. Um, so just over two thirds of entries uh, were sold. Uh, let's take a quick look at the entry list so that if you are in the draw, you can spot your name there. So we've got, uh, again, some very familiar names popping up. And again, seeing some new names in there. Welcome to you newbies. And of course, we do have some gaps in the list, uh, which can't be helped. And if we do happen to land on one of the gaps, we'll just roll it again until we find ourselves that lucky winner. So let's scroll back up to the top and pop in our parameters there. One, two, 150. Righty oh, quick look at the comments before I roll the random number generator. House fire, Johnny, yeah. Don't use the pizza oven inside the house. So, 
1 to 150 on the random number generator. 150 total tickets were available, 103 entries were sold. Good luck to all of you who have entered. Uh, this is an exciting one. Uh, I love to see these pizza ovens come through. Uh, I'm sure it won't be the last. Let's click generate and see who our winner is. Dun -dun -dun -dun, little drum roll. 47 for the pizza oven, number 47. Fingers crossed around the country. Let's see who our lucky winner is. We do have a winner. Uh, first time round. 47 on the random number generator, 47 on the uh, entry list. They won with us once before. I think they won the Halloween, yeah, they won the Halloween tableware set way back in, uh, in October. It's A. Gallagher from North Yorkshire. A. Gallagher from North Yorkshire, congratulations. You now own, to go with your Halloween tableware set, a pizza oven. <laughs> pretty cool, uh, pretty cool. Let's get your details popped in there before. I start rabbiting on about other things. 47, quick double check. Everything matches up. Hey Gallagher, congratulations. Don't know if you are watching, but uh, if you are there, would love to see you celebrate in the comments. Congratulations to you. We'll get that couriered off to you tomorrow. Radio, let's change this back to uh, camera only view because you don't need to see um, the screen behind me as clearly anymore. Look, I remember to do it for once. Uh, weeks and weeks and weeks that I've forgotten to change the camera view. Uh, and I finally remembered. It's because I have a big note underneath the camera there <laughs> reminding me to do it. Let's get that off the desk before the desk collapses. And let's have a chat about the, uh, about the draws that we're going to be launching tomorrow. Because as always, uh, Tuesday is draw night and Wednesday is when we launch our new draws for the coming week. So we do have three more prizes coming tomorrow. Quick look in the uh, in the comments just to see what's going on with you guys. Big congratulations from Samantha, from Nikki, pizza party in North Yorkshire, says Lisa. Yep, yeah, feel free to invite me. I'm not up in North Yorkshire very often, but I could probably make an exception for a pizza party. Big up to North Yorkshire, Sandy. Yeah, you definitely have a uh, North Yorkshire contingent uh, propping up the kitchen drawer at the moment. We love to see it, we love to see it. Radio. so tomorrow's draws. Uh, what have we got? Let's start with the obvious one, because um, you're pretty much guaranteed that each week we're going to have one. Uh, we've got an air fryer, uh, so everyone who has been entering the draws for the air fryers um, and hasn't won one yet, we do have more coming. Uh, so next week, we're launching tomorrow, we have the Tower Express Pro 10-in-1. So the Ninja that was won today is a dual drawer. Um, this one that just has one chamber, so obviously a lot more capacity in the one cooking space. Um, it's a 10 in one, so it does all sorts. In fact, there's a little list on the top there. Uh, air fryer, rotisserie, pizza, roast, kebabs, toast, grill, bake, dehydrate, char, grill. Um, putting toast on there feels like uh, a little bit cheeky just to get the number up to 10, but we'll, uh, we'll gloss over that. So, Another air fryer to cook your toast in, um, launching tomorrow. Uh, it's the Tower Express Pro 10-in-1. Um, it does have the rotisserie function, which is pretty brilliant. Um, you can buy an accessory, which is like a, um, a, an air frying cage. So you put your chips in there and it spins and you get a nice even cook. Um, so yeah, pretty versatile machine, that one. Uh, we have 150 entries available for it and we're gonna be selling those for three pounds each. Uh, that is the air fryer that we're launching tomorrow. So get your tickets for that if you are in the market still for an air fryer. Uh, Radio, let's look at prize number two that we're launching tomorrow. Prize number two is a pan set. Uh, this one is a Jamie Oliver Tefal collaboration. Um, so this is the Jamie Oliver Tefal 5-piece um, hard anodized pan set. As you can see, you get um, a large saucepan, um, a couple of smaller saucepans, all three of them have lids. Uh, you get the cooking pot, which comes with a lid, and you get the saute pan as well. Um, so a really uh, complete uh, pan set for you there. Trusted brand with Tefal, trusted um, collaboration, obviously, with Jamie Oliver. So you can't go wrong with these ones, really. Uh, they do work on all hob types, so they work on your gas, they work on your electric, and they work on your induction hobs. Um, I believe they're safe in the oven up to something like 210 degrees. Um, so yeah, pretty much a complete set in terms of 
uh, pans and what you might need there. Uh, we're selling tickets for that for three pounds each. And again, there's gonna be 150 entries available for that pan set. Um, yeah, we haven't done, uh, we've done T-Fold before, but we haven't done uh, the Jamie Oliver branded ones. Um, so quite cool to see that coming through. And I think the recommended retail price of this is over 400 pounds, 410 pounds from memory. Um, so yeah, not only is it a complete set, um, it's a pretty high value one as well. <clears throat> Tower is absolutely amazing, says Sandy. Love to see people vouching for the prizes now. We've got, uh, we've got that many winners that we can have people crop, cropping up in the chats and uh, vouching for the, for the prizes. I'd love to see that. I've invented a new thing, Nikki. Jamie Oliver, so it can't cook turkey twizzlers then? Absolutely not. No, you need an air fryer for that, Sam. Still going to get a ticket for them. That's what we like to hear. Right, so, yeah, prize number one, the air fryer. Prize number two, the pan set. Let's have a look at the final prize that we're launching tomorrow. Running out of space down here. Oi, come on. Final prize tomorrow will be an espresso machine. Um, so as you can see, because it's uh, spelled out in big letters on the front of the box, it's a Sage, um, but it is not the Sage Barista Express, as we've done quite a few draws for. It's the Sage Bambino, uh, the Sage Bambino Plus. Uh, so this one is not a bean-to-cup machine, this is an espresso machine. Um, so you will need to either buy pre-ground beans um, or have a separate grinder. And you can buy them on Amazon or from your local, uh, your local store for pretty affordable. Um, I've got a Krups one, I've had it for over 10 years and it's still going strong. So um, yeah, I wouldn't be too, uh, too put off by the fact that it isn't directly bean-to-cup because um, it's still Sage. Uh, very good brand in the coffee making industry. Um, you still get your porter filter, um, so you can control your dose. Um, you can still make singles, doubles. It's still got the uh, steam wand, so you can make your micro foam um, for your latte art. So it effectively does everything that one of the bigger machines would do for you, bar grind the beans. So that is the Sage Bambino Plus. Um, I believe this one is a particular colour as well. Can't see it there. Maybe it's there. I believe this might be sea salt coloured. Um, I'll have to double check. Obviously the details will be in the launch email um, and in the materials that go up on the website tomorrow. Pretty sure it's a, a sea salt coloured one, the Bambino Plus. Uh, tickets for that, £3.50. So just £3.50 to enter for the Sage Bambino Plus and 150 entries available. So pretty good value there, I think. Um, and yeah, being a bit more compact, as you can see, the box is a lot smaller than those Barista Expresses. So um, will fit in your kitchen a bit better than some of those larger models. So that's the three prizes that we are launching tomorrow. The air fryer, the pan set and the espresso machine. Uh, so hopefully uh, those are of interest to you guys um, and you, you want to snaffle up some tickets for those. Um, that's pretty much it from me. Um, how many trees have we planted? I know there's people who love to hear. Uh, we planted 100, 100, 1,344 trees. Uh, so thank you to everyone who buys tickets. Uh, it's you buying tickets through our website that allows us to get those trees planted and we will continue to do so. Um, and that's pretty much it for the update. I'm gonna uh, have a quick look at the comments before we sign off. Kelly, hashtag never forget the turkey twizzlers. Espresso martini machine, pretty much is Nikki. Fantastic shout, love an espresso martini. Johnny Whoop Trees Eye. Uh, so excited you uh, you couldn't couldn't finish your sentence uh guys look thank you so much to everyone who has joined us this evening uh thank you to everyone who watches this late uh thank you to everyone who entered as always um and good luck well congratulations to all our winners from tonight and good luck to everyone who enters our draws uh for next week that's it from me for one more week hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your evening have a fantastic rest of your week and hopefully see a bunch of you next Tuesday here, same time, same place. Take care, guys.
Cheers.